Hello and welcome to my Descript text-to-speech AI tutorial. This is going to allow you to pretty much take some text, turn it into speech, and then you can go from there. It's a very easy process, and if you haven't gotten to test out Descript, I will leave a link down below in the description where you can try them out for free. So here is just a simple intro or hook that I created using, and this is going to be for, say, a random YouTube video talking about why shorter videos are better. So I pasted this in here, and what we want to do once we have it, we want to click on speaker. We can use my voice if we want. I've actually done different videos about this if you want to check that out, but I'm just going to go to the stock voices and for this one, let's just say I'm going to go with Henry. Once I do that, you're going to want to let it load for maybe like 10, 15 seconds. What's going to happen, it's going to start editing there so that it can use the specific voice. You see like the underlines under there, that means it's going through. And of course, once you can see most of the words and this under it, that means that it's gone through and now we're going to have our text to speech. So. Once we go there, let's start at the beginning, and I'm going to let this play, and you can listen to it. Hey there, fellow YouTubers and viewers. Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're diving into the fascinating world of YouTube content and exploring why shorter videos are becoming increasingly popular and how they might just be the key to unlocking your channel's full potential. So, sit back, relax, and let's uncover the reasons behind the success of shorter YouTube videos all in under 5 minutes. All right, so not too bad. There's also going to be the aspect. I think I did a separate video about this as well, but if you want to publish and just export, this is where you can do that with the text to speech. So you can just get the audio if that's what you're looking for. Obviously, if you wanted something longer, you can add in much more, but this is a very easy process. Pretty much just creating a new um, project here, utilizing some content that you can paste in, and of course, selecting the voiceover that you want to utilize. And just like that, you have some text to speech, which you can export as audio if needed. I hope this very quick tutorial uh, showed you exactly what you were looking for. Like it says on the uh, screen in front of you, usually the shorter YouTube videos are the better ones. If you haven't gotten to test this out, the link for Descript will be down below in the description. My name is James. Thank you so much for watching, and I will see you in my next video.